Joining us, you're the uh, head performance engineer for Emirates Team New Zealand. We've had a, a wonderful late afternoon, early evening session out on the, the back paddock, and quite while it was difficult when we left, it got better as it as it went on. Um, Fifteen, maybe eighteen in the puffs, but less. Yeah, it's a bit, bit less on average, more, I think, 12 knots on average by the time we actually got out there, put up sails, if you actually look at the time I was sailing. Got you, yep. Um, and we had one instant, well, the, the um, LEQ12 started sailing, rolled into a jibe and stopped straight away, and then we saw a lot of guys and girls looking at the back end of the boom, well, where the boom would be. Uh, what was the issue there? Any ideas? Uh, yeah, there was a bit of a tech technological issue. Um, oh yeah, electronics guys uh, sort of took a little while to figure it out, but able to get going again, which was good, especially with the two boats on the water being one of the second day we could actually line them up together. <laughs> yeah, no, definitely. And, and when they were sailing together, they looked quite impressive. We did have a little, uh, well, our first um, maybe upside down with the AC40 today. Yeah, so, I mean, I'm on the chase boat following the LEQ, so not entirely sure on the details, but it sounds like they hit something in the water. Yeah. So following all the storm, um, yeah, there's a lot of stuff out there. As we tow out yesterday, it's like a whole poo to car a tree in the water and stuff, so. Yeah, no, definitely. Yeah. We're seeing we're seeing the state of the of the, the harbour sort of um, looking quite, quite uh, uh, stained from the, the rains we've had. Now, in the design world, obviously, we're, we're trying to refine down these foil shapes and, and then scale them up to the 75. Is there a ratio with cord thickness to area that's the magic number? I think it depends what you're sort of optimising for. So if you get a foil that's too thin, then it'll stall quite easily. So maybe in a take-off off situation where you're a bit more bow up, then that could not go so well then. But um, then once you're going fast, being thinner, it's less frontal area, less drag. So, so it's a trade-off, basically. Yeah. The, the, the fatter you go, the quicker you'll climb out, but the slower your top speed is. Yeah. Uh, so and, and have we got a, a window of those numbers that we know kind of where we're at, or we're still experimenting? Um, yeah, we're still exploring different options, and I mean, also looking at the likely conditions in Barcelona for what to optimise for. Now, we had a wonderful reach back up the harbour, both boats very close. Well, we, we did see the, uh, the LEQ-12 put her, her windward foil down for a bit to let the other boat catch up. May have been wind pressure or different conditions, but it does seem that your anhedral foil does have wheels. Yeah, I think it's a bit, a bit more challenging in the waves, but it's, yeah, I mean, there's a reason we made it. It's, yeah. it's because we think it's something that's going to be a bit better. Yeah, no, definitely. Yeah. So harder to use, but quicker. Yeah. Oh, nice. Uh, and over the weekend, we're not planning on sailing, we don't know yet. But, um, uh, yeah, the idea was if we sailed today, got a decent session in, then have the long weekend off. Long? So, ah, so you're, not, yeah. you're not crunching numbers over the weekend. <laughs> so we'll be back in on Tuesday, weather yeah. permitting, and it's a two boat program again for Tuesday? Yeah, yeah, it's really this little block now is really focusing on the two boats, the match racing, the who's looking out the window at what, and yeah, communication on the yachts. Is, Getting the systems focus. down and yeah, yeah. Uh, well it's, it's certainly we can see the progression it seems to be getting slicker and slicker obviously we had a, an oddball day today with mm. uh, with the weather keeping us a shore side for longer than we'd hoped but to still get two hour, two and a half hour sailing time in right at the end on a Friday yeah. I think you guys are doing really well. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. All right. Thank you. Have an awesome weekend and we'll see you Tuesday. Cool.